For Krimo Media in Johannesburg, this is the Real Economy Report. Beermaker Heineken has built a water reclamation plant at its City Bing Brewery in the Midval, investing in technology to reclaim and recycle the water used in its production processes and reduce the amount of water it sources from the municipality. Natasha Oerendahl has the story. The 2 million euro water reclamation plant was commissioned in March 2020 at the 8 million hectolitre a year brewery to help Heineken reduce the amount of water used in its production processes, in line with the group-wide 2030 water strategy, Every Drop, introduced in 2019. Heineken South Africa MPI and Master Plan Manager Richard Creel and Waterloo Sub-Saharan Africa GM Lawrence Devers tells us more. From a high level point of view on a, on a, a company wide uh, drive, there's a, a certain target that we've been set and it comes from the fact that water is scarce across the world. So we know that water is a problem globally and in terms of different countries, we highlighted as one of the 18 countries that are classified as water scarce. Uh, so basically that means that we, we need to be very careful in terms of the water we use. Heineken is working to reduce the amount of water it takes to produce its beer from roughly 4 litres of water for 1 litre of beer to 2.5 litres per 1 litre of beer by 2025. So within Heineken they've set targets to reduce that down to 2.5. So that means for every 1 litre of beer we're only allowed to use 2.5. We've been working on a lot of things to get that number down but the water reclamation is expected to deliver us around 0.5 of a, a hectolitre. So in terms of our, 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 our targets, we're not quite there yet. Due to COVID, we have had some challenges with our wastewater treatment plant and getting things stable. However, we are starting to see some, some good delivery and it really has helped our ratio uh, reduce. So we've gone down from four down to around 3.6 and we're hoping to hit 3.2 this year. Longtime Heineken partner Waterloo started the water reclamation project in 2019 with the water treated to 100% to World Health Organization potable water standards directed for utility use at the operation. We are partners with Heineken since uh, 2010 when this brewery was uh, started. Um, we are the, we constructed, Waterloo constructed the effluent treatment plant uh, 2010, second phase 2012 and then the final phase in 2019. And in 2019 as well Heineken decided to invest in a water reclamation plant and that's the plant you see behind us where we are actually taking the treated uh, final effluent and uh, polishing it further up to potable drinking standards according to the World uh, Health Organization. So the water that comes out of that plant after ultrafiltration, uh, reverse osmosis and uh, state of the art technology is then uh, being used back in the utility side of the brewery. Total capacity of the effluent treatment plant is around uh, 7,000, so that's 7,000 cubic meters a day, that's 7 million liters. Um, and out of that, around 30-40% is sent to the recovery unit, and the recovery unit is then producing uh, 45 million liters a month. And that's more or less the equivalent of uh, 18 Olympic swimming pools um, that the brewery is saving that way. Uh, water that they normally need to offtake from rand water, they are now saving by uh, the water reclamation plant. That's Crema Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy. Don't forget to listen to the audio version of our engineering news daily email newsletter.